So, when you said you were going to be doing stuff out here, I thought you were going to be doing this. That's boring work. That's I did. Work. I didn't know that you were going to be making more limbs. Yes, I've been making more limbs. Yeah, basically, I had gone to the tree before. Today, I went that way. And I got rid of some of the uh, sweet gums over there in the woods. This is not sponsored by SCNB. Not today it wasn't. Man. I mean, it's like every restaurant has forgotten how to serve quality indoor food. Every single place we've been since the pandemic started loosening up has been crappy food and crappy service. See, part of what I'm doing now is clearing out around them so that I'll have room to get up in there and pull the vines down. Tomorrow I'll actually get my chainsaw out and start cutting these stumps. I'm like, if you think I'm going back there, you lost your ever-loving mind. But, uh... Although, it's just a vine growing up in a tree. Not sure what that is. I think it's sulfur. Might be sign of a demon. Yeah, there's one of those seed pods hung up in there. I ought to see if I can, well, I may just let it grow another year at least, see if I can get it to grow a tree from a seed pod. And I'll just cut that one down and plant me another one somewhere. Oh, it got the grass cut, the trees are filling in. My redneck country mansion Cadillac lifestyle, whatever you want to call it. It's happy and peaceful. Actually, you chose a good time to show up. Mm-hmm. Because I have now, I'm trying to flank the crap. You're trying to what? I'm trying to flank the crap. So basically, there was a spot where it wasn't very many trees, so I've been kind of cleaning out around the property line, so then I can start working back this way. Allow me to take you on a journey. Wait. You said nothing about going inside the woods. I'm taking you in the woods, sweet cheeks. Yeah, but look, I... You got on shoes? <laughs> look, it's, it's as open as you can get back here. Well, I'm saving these nice willow oats because I might try to transplant these somewhere else in the yard. See, it was mostly just like tall plants back here, so I've just been weed eating, cleaning it out, trimming off the low-lying branches, low-hanging branches. Basically, the proper lines back here. See, it's like a nice clear path back here. And I went up in there with the weed. Got a lot of that cleaned out. I also noticed that big, beautiful willow oak right there. Also just over the property line. Not my tree. Now I need to get the chainsaw in here and start getting rid of the bigger things that I couldn't cut with the... Um, We, with the uh, head trimmers. I'm thinking about, I may make this part of my mowing cycle. Like I actually may leave a path big enough that whenever I mow the grass, I can just keep this cut. That way, even if that grows up over the season, I can keep it back here. Because this is wide enough that I could mow. So yes, that actually is probably part of my plan. This could definitely be some hammocky area here. Pretty much surrounded by trees. I would not enjoy it. But. Or, or even a gazebo. Screened in with pest repellent. And AC. And electrical surface and Wi-Fi. Then even you could enjoy it. And a covered porch patio all the way to the house so you wouldn't have to actually go outdoors. <laughs> but yeah, anything on this side. Like I could actually clear a path back through here. And like just make kind of a hidden little up the area up in here. Whew. We still need to review this. Uh-huh, this is awesome. 
That would be the quick review. 10 of 10 would buy again. Using my electric saw. Get rid of some of these tops. Wow. Oh well, I won't tear my rail one up anymore. And there's some things out here I kind of want to get rid of, clean them up. Um. Oh, I thought you were trying to tear down that big one with that. You mean this one? Yeah. I am. Huh? I am. Really? Which way is it? It's gonna fall that way, right? Yeah. So you're just gonna keep doing that? Pretty much. All right, I'm going back in. Okay because this is not fun to me. Too much outdoor for you? Yeah. You just right trying tool. to be a little quieter on a Sunday? Yeah, it's a tool I got. We all know, Man Law 579 is. The right tool for the job is the one you have. Even though you do have, you do have a yep. real chainsaw. Got like uh, two of them. Actually, three of them. All right. Have fun. Oh, well.